Um, good day, everyone. This is Manuel. And um, how do you send your PLC your classic profit? So I'll be taking you all through the step by step um, you need. So the first thing you want to do is to open your wallet. So let me just pause this video and type my password. So the moment you are done opening your wallet, now look at this wallet. Remember, when you see a wallet like this, it is not updated. It is not updated. So what we want to do is to go to our Play Store. So you come over to your Play Store right here, which is this. Your Play Store. Click on your Play Store and you want to search for Ultima Wallet and Farm. So let's click on the Ultima Wallet. The moment you click on the Ultima Wallet, what you want to do is to update the app. Um, so you want to update the app now look at it right here update update now what I want to do so you click on that update then you come over here you search for the farm also you update the farm also you click on update so you just hold on for it for some time let that update be done so let's check the wallet to be sure that um, it is done okay it's still coming up so let's just hold on for a while and um, wait for it to come up okay so let me okay it's almost done yeah so it is done like this now and um, the moment you are done updating your app it's going to reinstall like this then what you want to do is to probably you want to open the app so remember um, if you are sending the classic what you want to do is to use that our same address but uh, because the classic is just um our old PLC that is branded. So now that we are done um, updating the app, let us open the app so that we can. Um, so let me pause this. So I, I, I see many of us are saying, I can't find my money right here. Yes, you won't be able to find it because this is um, a new PLC. Now, all your fund has been moved to classic so what you want to do is just slide this to the right like this and you will find all your coins there now look at the value of the classic this is the value right here this value talks about 273 so what you want to do is since you collect the address from us this part that shows send look at it send so what you want to just do is to click on send but before you send the coin you must have an idea of the value your coin worth so if you are sending something like this this is the value it is like 10.02 dollars that's the current value right now if you are selling so if the price goes up this value is only going to go up so you can just check it that's 10 dollars so you have an idea you multiply it by um something like um 700 because they are still going to remove some charges but rough estimate you have an idea of what your fund is going to be so that's just going to be ten dollars than 700 that's going to be like seven thousand so let's say they do some charges and some other stuff they charge you on the coin but you have a, an estimate of um the fund of the fund you are going to receive so now since we are done with that already now what we want to do now is to you get the address from us so let me come over here now and um, let me copy the address so we are it's the same plc you address so let me just pick this person and um check when i sent um um the address let me see i think i have the address saved here okay good so this is the address now so you copy that address copy the address the moment you copy the address you come over to your wallet you want to click on your wallet
so you want to click on your wallet when you click on your wallet what you want to do now is to click on send so the moment you click on send um if you are selling everything you click on max if there's a unit that you want to just um sell part of you put it so let's say i want to sell just let me just use an illustration now if you are selling everything just click on this max here click on it but if you are just sending part of it type the unit you want to sell so let me say i want to send 0 0.001 now i'll click on next this place that shows paste the address that's our address you got from us just press it down and click on paste now you click on the advance right here and you pick receiver so when you click on receiver you click on send the moment you send it like this you wait for it to come up then when it brings congratulations you click on ok now the moment you click on ok you must see hold on this part that shows like a clockwise stuff that's it you click on it it's going to show you the transaction but you know this transaction is showing for plcu now you are going to click on this part that shows plcuc so when you click on that now look at it this transaction is showing zero percent so you can close the app and wait for it but you click on it when it shows hundred percent this is where i'm talking about it's going to show done at this part then you send me the screenshot and that's what you will send to us remember don't send the screenshot that does not carry this our address this is it receiver's wallet address it must carry every of your every of your screenshots must carry that address so if i'm doing something like this i'll just screenshot this when it shows done when i screenshot it i will send it so that's how you can send your profit but my own best advice the value of this our classic is kind of low and they've given us the ratio of swapping one to one i would suggest you swap to the new plcu that is nineteen thousand, and you wait for five years because you'll be selling them at a high price and moreover every every year there's a certain percentage of the coin that will be dropping for you so when it drops you can always sell so you can do that it's it's a it makes sense to do that because the moment you are done with this and you sell it you are gone you don't have any coin you don't have anything another thing is that if you are scared you don't want to do it you can decide to buy the u at a cheaper price the c let's say you buy what of fifty thousand, then you can stake it for that five years then you can leave this remaining one hoping for the day it goes up but if you want to take the profit at the current value you can do that so you have an idea of the the fee you are going to collect so that is how you can swap it remember update your app first and send it to us so if you have questions regarding this you can always reach us to on us on whatsapp and we would definitely reply you so um for those also that are sending the x that's the same process your x is the same process so it does not have um there's no any difference it's just um the same way so um thank you god bless